You guys, coming up next, you've seen her on Spike TV, True TV. She's one of my favorite comics. Please welcome Karen Feehan. Keep it going for Hamza, you guys, please. Please. And don't stop clapping. Keep it going for my high-waisted pants. Oh. I always buy pants like this. I can't stop. I'm like, those are great. They're going to make me look so skinny. Nah, they just make me look like I have the world's longest vagina. <laughs> well, walking exclamation point, you guys. Makes sense. Sex with me is exciting. Hey! I'm serious. I have an entire bottle of cranberry pills in my purse right now. It's my UTI girl up front. What's up, girl? Yeah! I stay humping. I love it, you guys. I am always on top. That way it's way easier to give out high fives to the imaginary people in my room. I'm up there killing it. By far, my favorite sexual, sexual position, though, is uh, reverse cowgirl, right? Because it's way easier to text other dudes while you're up there. <laughs> Sup, Chuck? <laughs> I've been banging a smart guy. I should preface that. Um, my ex was an actor, <laughs> right? We can all agree that word is synonymous with high-functioning Down syndrome, right? <laughs> So fucking stupid. No, babe, you can't spell quiche the way you think it sounds. <laughs> Fiji is not in Hawaii, and I'm not having this argument again. <laughs> he would say shit to me like, babe, 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 I just, I really want to do something important. <laughs> so I was like, why don't you open a checking account? <laughs> you fucking idiot. Oh, I love it. I uh, actually had a palate expander as a child. Anybody know? But yeah? They were like, she's gonna like black guys. Let's crack this thing open. <laughs> Make it easier for everyone. I think it's so weird when people ask me if the guy I'm dating is good in bed. I'm like, what do you mean? I'm good in bed. I don't even know what he's doing there half the time. It's like, here, buddy, bite down on this. It's gonna get weird. <laughs> I actually got dumped recently. I know, with these abs, it's garbage. But I got dumped. I'm gonna be fine. I'm gonna be A-OK. -okay. I've been making a lot of eye contact on the train. <laughs> so, I downloaded all the dating apps, all of them. I was on Tinder for 72 terrifying hours. Oh my God, every conversation is the same. Hi, I'm Karen, every guy. Cool, where do you live? <laughs> so scary. There's only one dating app I like, only one, and I swear by it, it's the best. I don't know if you guys have heard of it. It's called Uber. Right? Five to seven minutes, you got a new boyfriend and he has an Ultima. <laughs> they always have gum and water too. It's like they know I just threw up in my mouth. Um, I am an alcoholic though. I'm coming up on one year, no alcohol, no booze. Thank you. Thank you. I got my first tattoo, it says, don't serve me. <laughs> I did my part, you guys. Okay, <laughs> your problem now. <laughs> I still smoke weed though, because I'm not a fucking nerd. Uh, <laughs> I smoke so much weed. I started doing this thing where I pretend like I forgot my keys at home, just so I can go back and smoke more weed. <laughs> I live in like sort of a scary neighborhood too and I get so high before I leave my house. And it really came to a head the other day when I got on the L train, looked down and realized, oh yeah, I'm still holding the garbage from my home. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Oh, I gotta get a boyfriend. I texted, I'm trying to get one. I texted this comic. There's this guy comic, right? He talks about working out all the time, We're going to the gym, pumping iron. So I texted him. I was like, hey, do you ever train people? He was like, that's mad random, me and who else? I was like, no, 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 just me and you. And he said, well, that's not a train then. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> quality, quality. Oh, I'm doing fine with these little titties. Little baby 32 ways here to play, you guys. You're too little for cancer. You're too little. <laughs> right? <laughs> Why, come on, if they don't even fit in that squeeze them up machine, what's it called? I don't know, like, give me a lollipop, get me out of here. <laughs> I got my teeth x-ray, the dentist was like, oh, by the way, we got your tits in there too, you're good. <laughs> you're fine. I told this chick at Victoria's Secret my bra size, and she was like, um, but we don't sell batteries here. <laughs> She's dead now. It's my secret. It's my secret. Oh, I still wait tables because I went to college. I work brunch. Sorry, I crush brunch. And it gets super busy, but I've developed a great technique. When I know a table's gonna ask me for something, as I walk by them, I just keep my eyes shut. I fucking love picturing these assholes. Like, can I get a... She asleep? <laughs> this guy complained to me once. He's like, excuse me, miss, miss. Uh, I've been waiting for my eggs Benedict for 90 minutes. I was like, why? <laughs> why would you just leave, you know? <laughs> I'm high, man. I ate your Benedict. <laughs> right? It's like, get the fuck out of here. People are so dumb. You guys know that old saying, like, seatbelts aren't for everyone, you know? <laughs> I just feel like more people should be rolling the dice. <laughs> I, am, uh, I am responsible enough to have a dog now, which is really great. Dogs are awesome, you guys. They're just like kids, but you can hit them a little. <laughs> I had this weird story with this guy once. All right, I'll just tell you guys. I peed this guy's bed once. I know, I know, I know. I, know. I felt really bad, because usually I don't give a fuck. <laughs> But this time I felt really, really bad. But I woke up and I realized, oh, this guy is a dog. He's like, you know what, maybe I brought some pee in here, but I can bring some out. I'll take this dog for a walk right now. I take it for a walk around the block, get back to the high rise where this guy lives, realize I have no idea what apartment this guy lives in. <laughs> I'm knocking on doors with a half-dead basset hound like, is this your dog? Did I fuck you last night? Let me smell your dick. <laughs> That's how you know. I gotta go. I, uh, I want to be on TV, you guys. I think I can get on one of those intervention shows real fast, right? Right? You see the show Addicted? The alcoholic on that show sucks. All this guy does is pound a gallon of vodka, vomit, and pass out. Next day, does the same thing. Pounds it, vomits, passes out. I'm watching this, I'm like, come on, buddy. Get in your car. <laughs> you guys are awesome. I'm Karen Fee, have a great night. <laughs> Karen Feehan, everybody, keep it going.